What's going on guys, happy Wednesday. Obviously, uh, we're gonna be doing this professional style uh, video from now on, so uh, I'm glad you guys are tuned in. And I can tell you right now that today's topic is probably one of the, the most uh, endearing things that I heard in high school that I didn't appreciate, okay? And it's kind of one of those things that took me on the, the path that I'm on right now, which is the power of momentum, the power of outside forces, the power of something else getting you in motion, which is, you know, it, there could be something that you're not doing right now. There could be something that you want to do differently. There could be something that, um, you know, should change in your life. And that's the thing is, if that is to happen, it, you know, Tony Robbins says, if it's to be, it's up to me. Okay, that's an easy way to say momentum or action or execution. I'll give you the story. So my mom's in the city and she was talking about, oh my gosh, I saw your BPI live. So BPI is obviously the company that I own, uh, the brokerage here in Manhattan. We go live pretty much every single day and we talk about things that mean the most to the consumers. You know, obviously this is my personal channel. This isn't my business channel, but the business channel, I just give whatever, you know, kind of like right here, I just give a ton of information. And my mom's like, you're giving away all your secrets. I'm like, mom, I don't think you understand. I'm like, it, it's not about the information. It's not about uh, someone, it's about execution. Everything is about execution. It's about actually doing it. It's about actually going to the gym. It's actually about making the calls. It's about, you know, scheduling your social media or, or scheduling in writing for your blog it, or, you know, approaching that person at a networking event. It's all about doing that you know what you should do. You know that you need to do certain things to get what you want, but you're not willing to take the actions. That's the difference. And, and, and honestly, I'm looking at it now and I'm like, there's a lot of people not taking action. There's a lot of people not actually doing what they should be doing. There's a lot of people that are actually stagnating. There's a lot of people with outside forces. Outside force could be social media, TV, uh, a bad relationship, it could be money, it could be expenses, it could be mindset, it could be their body, their health. There's a ton of things that are actually on the outside acting on the inside, okay? More than ever, and it's only gonna get worse, okay? Because back in the day, we didn't have a device that we traveled around with. We didn't have the amount of interpersonal connections and uh, escapism that we have right now, the amount of content that we're able to consume in a single day. You know, they, they said it, they said the amount of content that an individual actually consumes in a week was the amount of stimulation that someone received their entire lifetime when we were scavengers, when we were out on the fields, you know, like how much would we act? We would obviously be fearful when we were in a battle situation. We would be fearful if we were getting attacked by an animal. And most of the other times it was just survival. It was picking berries. It was, you know, building things, building huts. And now we can literally look at someone else building a hut in that amount of stimulation, which is all these all the, the sound, the visual, your mindset, all these things that are just triggering it, how do we actually get into motion? How do we actually get into action? We have to cut off the things that we know we should not be doing. You know, Apple is coming out with this really good app. You know, some people say it's an attack on Facebook, it's an attack on, on email, it's an attack. No, no, no. They understand that the device is not being used as a tool right now. The device is being used as an escape, an outlet, uh, not being personal, personalized, you know, that, that's really what is being used. It's, it's being abused. It's not being used. That's the problem right now. So when I say objects in motion, stay in motion. That's why things are not coming towards your way. That's why there is no outcome that's happening because there is no outside force, me and you, that are acting on the results that we want. Making the calls, going to the gym, you know, they, they oh, he's lucky. He's got the genes. No, that person went to the gym. Or they're, they're smart, they have the network. No, they actually went out and got the network. They actually went out and closed the business. So if there is no momentum, or if you are stagnant, you know, look at a pond. A pond grows weeds, it grows mold, or whatever that is, it, like just a bunch of crap that you can't drink. But a rushing, running water, that's everything. That momentum can't be stopped unless it's dammed up, okay? So if you're sitting there and you're thinking, why are the things in my life not happening? The reason being is that there is no outside force acting on you, which is a why. It could be, it could be a good or a bad why. The bad why is a bankruptcy, a breakup, a divorce. Uh, you know, it could be your business just failed. 
You know, I, and I'll give you this example of the outside, this is a perfect example actually. So I'm looking down at the salad place I go to. I'm here in New York City, this is the wall of windows. So the, the salad place I go to right down there. The, the person behind the counter goes, I got this great idea. <laughs> Never heard that one before. I'm like, okay, great, I'm all ears. He goes, delivering coffee through an app. I'm like, well, they have a lot of delivery service. He goes, no, 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 it's just coffee. I'm like, it's all right, you know. He's been talking about it now for a month and a half. Month and a half, no action. So you have this stagnant idea because it's just an idea right now. There needs to be an outside force that actually acts on that. That is buying the domain name, building out the app, looking at the UI, UX, what's the user experience? How am I gonna get funding? How am I actually gonna do this? I need delivery people. Do I have any overhead? What's the overhead? Do I have a domain and a website and everything else? That, that's the outside force to move into momentum. That's the outside force. Right now, there's nothing acting on it. Nothing, it's just an idea. It's all about execution. As my mom was talking about yesterday, she's like, you're giving away all your information. No, 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 I'm giving away this, but someone needs to move it. Someone needs to move that pendulum. Someone needs to start the business. Someone needs to go to the gym. Someone needs to eat correctly. That's what it comes down to. Well, I have a wedding coming up, so I'm just gonna get on a diet. No, 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 it's a lifestyle. And I'm not saying this preaching, I'm just saying this, this is the macro that we're gonna have to deal with through our whole life. Okay, it doesn't matter what area it is, okay? You could, you could have one pillar of health. You can have one pillar of wealth. So if you're talking about wealth and you're saying, you know what, actually, um, I overspend. That outside force is you swiping the credit card, you going on your app, you doing something that you shouldn't be doing, and then you can't save money. You're not building out the wealth. You're not actually being able to purchase real estate, you know, as Grant Cardone would love you to do, because that's all he's talking about right now. So if you guys, not only felt this was helpful, uh, you know, if you got something out of this, leave in the comments below, subscribe to the video. Um, obviously, this is a higher quality way that we're gonna be going, then we're gonna build out uh, some thumbnails and things like that. So if you guys are interested in any ideas that you want me to talk about, leave in the comments below. We have probably about five days of content, and then I kind of just add to it as I uh, you know, get quotes or ideas or things happen in my life. So leave in the comments below. Talk to you guys soon.